All right, this is my very first RC plane that I designed and built on my own. Um, obvious, as you can see, I call this thing my ugly stick. Uh, just blue core and duct tape. I used one carbon fiber rod for the main spar there, but uh, that's about it. Just a bare bones basic airplane. After viewing a bunch of videos of Dave over at uh, RC Superpowers, I really liked his idea of mounting the control surface directly to the servo control horn here. That way, in the event of a crash or anything, the servo or the uh, control surface just pops right off and is really easy to reattach. So that way, nothing actually breaks, which in my mind is a good thing. So uh, just for the test phase here, I've got all my electronics kind of hanging out. Um, but eventually, once I get this thing nice and stable and flying the way I want it, I'll tuck all that stuff inside there and try to improve airflow through the fuselage. Here's my uh, hole for the battery. And it actually flies remarkably well for being as ugly as it is. The, the Elevons took some tweaking with the uh, mixing and everything, but they are seeming to work fine. And I'm glad I decided to put a rudder on it. I almost opted out for a rudder and just have a uh, vertical stabilizer, but I'm glad I stuck with the rudder. <laughs> um, and one, one thing I decided to add to this airplane, because I can't have just a regular airplane, is a very crude system of mounting and releasing a glider from the top of the airplane. I just got this extra servo here, and this uh, control horn is not screwed in, it's not fixed to the servo, so it can just pop off. But what happens is, I uh, get the glider in here, and the fuselage goes right through there, and the, this pin goes through another carbon fiber rod in the glider, and I slide them into place like this, and then when I flip the switch, the servo rotates, the pin comes out, and the glider is released. So, kind of fun. I'm going to take it and fly it for some 6th uh, graders next week, so they should get a kick out of that. Again, the fuselage is really simple. That was my main goal here, just to keep things simple. And I did that. I just uh, cut a length of uh, blue core here, scored the rough side, reinforced the, um, the opposite side here with duct tape, and then just folded it into thirds where I scored. Pretty simple. Um, actually remarkably strong. I did some preliminary tests on a, just a triangular stock piece like this and held up pretty well actually. And this is the glider I used. A, uh, one of the few remnants left over from the last 4th of July. Kind of made a tradition of having a little contest with who can make the best rocket glider. Here you can see this airplane seen better days but like I said, one of the few that actually survived. And uh, this little hole right up here, that's where the, the pin goes through that's connected to that servo to make it release. So, there we go. Beautiful. Scrap video of this.